that's loud. loud. <laughs> that's loud. Oh, oh that's loud. I, I feel like suddenly we were on SNL. I was like, ooh, hot mic, hot mic. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, all you Dooligans. Welcome to another edition days right here on AfterBuzz TV, where we recap your favorite NBC soap opera days of our lives. Thank you guys so much for joining us live, and thank you so much for liking our Facebook page Yay. and our Instagram page. Um, if you haven't already, make sure you go to Facebook, like us, comment. We have all sorts of wonderful stuff on there, and also we're on Instagram. Check out those as well. Um, all under Edition days. Right. Um, before we all get started, some exciting news from our, well, our very own Mr. Mark J. Freeman. Yes. What do you have going on, sir? Um, on October 3rd and 4th, in a perfect romantic getaway town like Niagara Falls, <laughs> I will be hosting the Q&A for Billy Flynn's fan of Whoa. Oh. <laughs> He's letting me back in his vicinity. He hasn't called security on me yet. Congratulations. Yeah, no, we've been talking about it for a while, so um, everything just kind of just kind of official now. It's oh, all together. Good. There's it's a lot good. of Very things exciting. that are official when it comes to you and Billy Flynn. <laughs> He did propose on the postcard to me after the show, so <laughs> for the record. Just saying. Just saying. <laughs> and, of course, you guys know oh. about what. Oh. <laughs> Before, can we say, can I say, uh, Stephen, that first picture that I sent you, can you throw that up real quick? Because uh -oh. during the show last week, you kept saying how Billy wasn't getting to you at all. He didn't. Okay, because uh -oh. I watched it again, yeah. and I found this, and I was like, oh, it looks like Billy got to him. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, FYI, oh, my I think God. he got to you, <laughs> Mr. Man. Um, that is the look of love if I have ever seen it. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. That was love in his eyes. Oh I will God. have you know, that is my I am paying attention to all that's going on. <laughs> Uh -huh. I'm gonna watch and after she's done and you see if you, if, you, if you look at if you look at all of them. I'm always like this. It's just how. Oh, is that me? Oh, yes. that's me. Sorry, that's it's me. how it's how I pay attention to everyone. I that's just kind of do this. I want to see that. <laughs> you, will. you will see that. You will. You will see that. Thank you, I Steven. promise. Thank I that's promise. hilarious. That's why he sent the picture. That's, that's why. That's hilarious. He kept saying, "Send me the pictures right. you want to put up." And I'm yeah. like, "Uh-uh, I got oh, something I'm putting up. You ain't seen it till I put it up." That's good. That's good. Well, James and I. I've talked about that. Yeah. I have that face. It happens. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 seriousness. There's times when we're doing something and he'll be like, because that's my I'm paying attention right. to you face because you're right. talking. Mm -hmm. He does that sometimes. It happens. It happens. I feel like you're doing it with me right now. I am. <laughs> I am. He's paying I attention. He's paying attention. I like it. Uh, well, if you guys don't know who we are already, uh, I am your host, uh, Tony Moore, and I am also joined by my other chocolate twin, James Law Jr. <laughs> and of course, you guys know the future Mrs. Billy Flynn. We have. Don't tell Gina. Uh, Mark J. Freeman. And of course, we have a very special guest with us. She is bright eyed and Bushy Tail, she is <laughs> the one and only Miss Melissa Arstro. Hey! Also known as Serena. Oh, yeah. Serena Mason. Well, yeah. yes, yes, yes. You know, making her way through Salem. Yeah. Not this week, but... Uh, <laughs> Not this week. <laughs> <laughs> but I can tell you everything she was doing off camera. Oh, good. Okay, good. Okay, good. We, like we, to wanna, that. we want to know all of that. Yes. Those are, best, those are the best stories. Yeah, those are. Like when yeah. they're here. Yeah. When yeah. We, talk, we talk about something, they're like, oh, this happened. Right, right. Two seconds later, I'm like, oh, that's the stuff I that, love. See, that's the stuff yeah. they cut. I agree. See, that's, yes. why, yeah. that's why I try to fill you guys in. Like, when Maxine's son is there shopping and stuff, I gotta let you guys know. Like Maxine's son. Does like she know about Max, do you know about Maxine's son? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm uh, well, this is Maxine's son. Oh. Yeah. He's, future. he's future trying Maxine's to son. Yes. get yeah. to the casting department. Do it. <laughs> Marty, if you're watching. It is, go it is gonna happen. It is gonna happen. Step Say it out loud. And and Maxine. And Maxine's Maxine. yeah. son. Yeah. He's a Demira, too. Yeah. Mm. Interesting, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Some more black Family. Demiras. Mm -hmm. more black Demiras. We leave them. Well, we are all very anxious to get right into it because this week back started school. the... um back school hungry. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yay! Yay! That is hilarious. Pizza, great job. Right. We could 
could not start this without our pizza yeah. rolls. It might be a little hot, so we when might wait. When am I supposed to turn we're that off? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to do it right now, but, right that's, now. but that's what we that's, have. That's Steven, kind of you are you are amazing. Steven, Tino. that was the best. Totinos, if you are watching, yes. uh, we would love to be sponsored by you <laughs> here at Vision Days. I contacted you about a couple weeks ago, so look Just for James Lodger. Just Totinos. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah. Wow, yeah. that was great. Thank you. Right? <laughs> yeah. We follow, we follow direction well. Oh, we yeah. Do. Like oh, we do. Well, speaking of following directions, yes. let's get right into it right. with um, our recap of Days of Our Lives. So it's time to start Dish and Day. Yes. <laughs> like, are, are we saying that? Oh, oh yes. yeah. There we go. Yeah. There we go. Like Santa the Hourglass. Yeah. You don't want it's like a baby. And was it just there. me? Is the beginning a little different? The oh, the days yes. of our lives opening a, a little bit. bit. It's a little, different. A little, it's a, he slightly. starts talking sooner, right? Really? Yeah, a little bit. Just a little bit. I didn't know. I, so. I could have been. I wrong. caught it. No, I caught it. I think it did. Nice. It, you tell us at home if you think we we're just crazy. Yeah. I was drinking, but this should be fine. If you guys are, are I, I was. Oh no, I got it. Mm-hmm. I was. I was looking down. So. <laughs> Um, so if the opening is new, let us know. Um, the thing is, I just have to just even begin this whole thing off. What a difference a day makes. Two days. I'm saying, I'm saying that Wednesday, it was starting right. Wednesday, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm just saying that from Tuesday to Wednesday, right. Wednesday's episode was amazing. We're going to talk about that because we're going to start off this conversation with one of my favorite people in the whole world, Chris Alfonso, which is Hope. Yes. And this last half of the week, we got Hope. A we lot. got lots of hope. Yes. Because you know, you a lot. And that made I'm me... I'm not saying it like a bad way. Like a lot. <laughs> I'm just and saying, it's a lot. A James lot. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> He's not waiting to say that. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that was good, wasn't that's that's good, wasn't it? Um, but anyway, so we have... So we're going to talk about Hope, Aiden, Clyde, Rafe. That kind of, that's all kind of a... They're all in there somewhere. Yeah. And what I loved about Wednesday's episode is that it kicked off with a bang with, with Aiden and Clyde, first of all, mm-hmm. fighting. I liked it. Okay. okay. I love violence. So, so do I. He's on me. So I was like, I love violence it. on television is great. It really is. But is that bad? Was what? <laughs> was no, at all? SLC, was any, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> was anyone else thinking? Clyde, how old are you? And Aiden, oh, how old okay, are you? Well, and was... Aiden, you are getting your ass whooped by Clyde. <laughs> there was that, but I, but I actually felt that Clyde was menacing for change. He was. I did feel, I did feel like there was a difference in yes. his writing. Like I, did, I did notice a big like, yeah. He was like, he was like when, he was, when he was that was very profound. That was great. It was that like, great profound? Thank you. But like he was Thank slapping you. him around a little bit and talking crap to him yeah. and beating him up just here and there. I like it, to me it was like old fashioned soap where the guys had actually got a chance to fight each other, not just yeah. shoot him, you're dead. I mean it was like they fought yeah. all around that room. Yeah, they did. Up and through that room. They fought. And I just felt for a change. Clyde I actually saw something different, like Oh, I can see him being that country bumpkin who is kind of scary, kind of. Like, yeah. okay. See, and that's so funny because I kind of always thought that about him a little bit because okay. he was a little like quiet and he's a little. I just always felt like because he was, th- there wasn't enough. Like you just knew there was something. Okay. Yeah. You know, okay. like a little evil lurking underneath. Mm-hmm. Well, see, for for me, like when you compare him to someone like Victor or Stefano, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. like oh. you look at those men and you're like. Uh, if you come around the corner, like, I'm scared. Like, I'm either about to be kidnapped, sure. drugged, stabbed, <laughs> shot, yeah. something is about Impregnated. to Impregnated. Right. Yeah. Like, yeah. When Clyde yes. comes around, it's like, can I get a biscuit? Like, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> I see, I, I don't know. Like, I always felt like he was, uh, like, something else was lurking underneath. You know, he's that neighbor that no one knows is the serial killer, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. I, I don't that. mean that he's a serial killer. Right. She's not saying it's <laughs> oh, like, she's like, like <laughs> yeah, she's not, not, not anyway. hinting to anybody. No, I think no that spoilers. would be too obvious anyway. Yeah, right. Anyway. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Point, right. Well, I first of all, when when Clyde came in, it's almost like, why did you go through the effort of like the gloves and the mask right. only to get into the room and go, Papa, it's me. Yeah. Like, right. you know, like right. exactly. I don't, was, I don't know. But it reminded me of old days a little bit. Yes. It reminded me kind of like there was like like a, a, a time backwards. And then of course when Hope comes in and Aiden's like really because now we know Aiden has something else going on to you. Yes. Yeah. And we don't know what it is yet, do we? Don't no. know, well, right? well, he has something on Clyde. He has something it's on like, Clyde. We know that we don't know part, but there's like, yeah. yeah, we don't know. There's something going on there. So it's kind of like, oh my God, hope he really hurt me. You know what? It was just like, and she was just like being beautiful, hope, and yes, and not being the detective, of course. But then she turns into detective. I was gonna say, she, then she did. You say, then she did. The first thing she does is yes. like, I'm gonna call the police. At least, yeah. Yeah. At least. Yeah. I yes. need a paycheck. Was I the only one who <laughs> felt like um, hope? Aiden is like bleeding everywhere. 
I don't think a kiss is warranted. Yeah, I know. That like, was kind of. Wait until yeah. he wipes his face. Maybe wipes his lips <laughs> yeah. or something. Yeah, and then... but the blood's a little salty. It's probably like, <laughs> yeah, some kind of cool. <laughs> a little bit of iron. This isn't Fifty Shades of Days. Days. <laughs> okay. Maybe it is. Oh. Mm. Uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> now, um, I have to say the other part of the storyline that a lot of fans actually were kind of mixed on, I saw online, um, when Julie, because Julie was kind of the conduit of the first episode. Mm-hmm, she kind mm-hmm. of found herself with her, then with Marlena. She's like, right. And then they finally talked about Bo. Right. So there was a lot of talking There was a lot Bo. of talking about Bo. There was, the Wednesday episode, <laughs> there was a lot of conversation. Like, you were John and Marlene, which we'll talk about later. It was a lot of conversation. I saw there was a difference. It wasn't yeah. just like cut scene, cut scene, right, cut scene, like right, the yeah. past. It was like, we're going to sit and we're going to talk. But yeah. but I felt like that that conversation is prepping us for mm-hmm. the return of Bo. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's kind did. of like, you know, fans, in case you forgot, like, <laughs> Bo is around, mm-hmm. and guess what? He's a common. And right. now it's we have to figure out how Hope feels about mm-hmm. Bo. I agree. And, and I like how she was just kind of like, it was hard for me to yeah. get over Bo because, I mean, he's the only person that she's ever been with. Right. Mm-hmm. Um, and that, and once she was able to release him, right. she was able to let Aiden in. But now I'm just kind of like, well, now Bo, you're going to come in and mess everything up because right, right. I like... I like you Hope like, with Aiden. I like it. I like, it. I like Hope and Aiden. I do too. Eric called Serena off camera this week okay. and told her all about what was going on with Bo. And, and yeah. I was like, I was really surprised. Really? Really? <laughs> we were all surprised. You were like, you were like, Bo, really? You were like, Bo, oh my yeah. gosh, crazy. Well, and I thought it was really great that Eric felt like he could uh, call you, call me. Yeah, yeah. You. that's true. Or call her. I mean, oh, we call her. Yeah, call you. Because Eric hasn't been very happy with you. No, no but I mean, he, you know, he seems a little more forgiving. Yeah, I but mean, he, especially with that. He was a priest. Yeah. He should forgive you. Right? Yeah. Right? Hello? But hence, Hello. The, hence the word was. Oh, yeah, well, that, well, that, well, that was, that was, that Call was the word. Call us off, Now he, like, you know, almost had sex and, um, and the, and the little spaces. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I wasn't with Mike. <laughs> it sure wasn't. You were in order vicinity. But I thought, I thought that Hope was speaking for the audience, kind of. Mm-hmm. Like, so that they can, we can kind of say, okay, this is why she went with Aiden. This is why if Rafe likes her, it's okay. It's kind of like, yeah. this is what Bo did. I mean, or, or, you know, what the writers did to Bo, basically. Yeah. Right. And what they did to him. And I kind of explained everything to all to everybody saying this is what's going on and Bo's will be back soon don't worry yeah. you know yeah. kind of and get us ready well, uh, Melissa did you were you familiar with days back then when, oh, yeah. when Bo was on um, I knew about it because my friend's mom watched, watched it so that was like the big couple yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you, what, what, what's your thoughts like do you think you would want to see Bo or Hayden oh wow that's um it's a challenge. Or, I don't know. Right? Yeah. Right? It yeah. is a challenge. Or, or rope. Yeah. Oh, oh Rafe. Because yeah. yeah. Rafe, I mean, Galen Guerin is a leading man. It needs, yeah. to, be, it needs to be, you know, leading. I this kind is true. of, I kind of like them. I like their chemistry. Rafe and Hope? Yeah. yeah. I do too. I do too. Yeah. Yeah, I do. But, um, I don't know. I mean, it's always kind of cool, too, to have the, the old super couple. Yeah. yeah. You know, I think that's great for fans. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I, I like the triangle probably more so. Yeah, well, right. of course. That's, that's way more yeah. exciting. Right. There's, okay. there's always a triangle. You know, let's, be. If, let's see. If we could put Serena with someone, mm-hmm. who who do you guys think would be best match I with would, Serena? I like Rafe. With yeah. Serena? Yeah. I, you know, I didn't think about that until the way over here. I was like, yeah. Rafe had no one. Oh, he could have had Serena. Yeah. He could have. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> She's like, you could have. It's not even a pause. She was like, yes. You barely got that out of your mouth. And she was like, yes. I I wanted to see this whole thing with Xander. I was like, they could so be Bonnie and Clyde. Yeah, Yeah. totally. Yeah, yeah. 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 Actually, that would have, I mean, I was kind of rooting for Xander and Nicole at one point in time. Mm, Really? Yeah. Oh, 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 oops, oops. <laughs> so I thought we were friends. But, <laughs> but, but, <laughs> but, <laughs> but I mean, you know, they I don't know, it was kind of like at the time before we went before we knew Xander went cool for Cocoa Puffs. Yeah. Oh right. Like, you yeah. know, I kinda could see Nicole and, yeah. and Xander together. Well, and, I, and I kinda left Serena with Eric to rekindle that. But. I, I think what we liked about um 
uh, Xander and Nicole was that Xander was pursuing Nicole. Yeah, right. yes. And we all sure. felt like more of the guys on the show should have, she's beautiful. Yeah. She's like, you know yeah. what I mean? Like, I get that they, her bad side and all that stuff, but we, I just loved that somebody finally was like, you're hot and I need to know you and right. I'm going to chase agree. after you and I want a piece of that. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, like, right. I think that that's what we've generally liked about Xander when he first came Because yeah. your character was kind of like this strong woman already. You kind of right. came in yeah. like I'm Serena, and I don't take any. I don't crap. care about you. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah. You're like I'm in something, but Nicole is always like she's chasing after a man. Yeah, and um. yeah, it's kind of like so. That's what we kind of thought. But you guys were good together too. You and Xander were good. I wish Xander would stay on the show. I think there's so many potential storylines for him. He he is around. He's yeah, he's but, working shirtless yes. in which I'll mention. Oh, that's right. I saw yeah. some yeah. orange yeah. jumpsuit photos though this week. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So wait, has that aired yet? No, no, uh, no. Uh, no. Uh, people are teasing us. People are leaking stuff out this. because now it's begun. Like now this is the beginning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, the, that's it. Do you have Wi-Fi? It's my end of days. <laughs> <laughs> uh, crazy, thank you. crazy. Oh, thank so you. Thank you. Um, yes. I mean, I connected with Serena when she first came on because she was always late for everything. Yeah. So I mean, you were like, yeah, you were oh, your thing. Yeah. He's like, oh. yeah. <laughs> so that, that I, was I your thing. Yeah. yeah, that was yeah. your thing. You were always late. Yes. We could have been. We had to wear watches in scenes until I was like, you know, I could just pull out my iPhone. Right. But I think I had a whole thing about that. I said I, yeah. I'm the only one who wears a watch anymore. Yeah, you did say that. But I don't yeah. ever change the time. No. <laughs> <laughs> it just always reads late. Well, I, well for me, like I said, this storyline, I thought, I thought it's on, on to the right direction. Like, they just, they're just setting up hope. I like that they were having good, good conversations. Clyde seems a little more scarier to me now. Yes. And Aiden's hiding something, which is always good television. And that whole thing when, when Aiden was in his hotel room and, you know, he knew that hope was coming back and he started trashing yes, the room and, extra and like, throwing... Yes. I wonder what he was doing at first. I'm like, why is he throwing right. stuff out the yeah. window? Right. Yeah, he's trying to make it. He, yeah. he knew what, what story clicked, he was, was going like, to tell. Oh, yeah. yeah, right. Because he couldn't say, like, oh, it was Clyde. Right. And then, of course, everyone's like, you know, we're going to get forensic in here. And, right. and he finally lost it. He was like, okay, enough. And mm-hmm. I'm like, don't give yourself away because Clyde will come back and mad <laughs> yeah. ass again. Mm-hmm. Like, but, be careful. But wasn't that scene kind of creepy when Clyde and Mimit outside the house or whatever? Yeah. And they were all like, what's like, like, what? be out here. Yeah, I was like, what? Mm-hmm. But I kind of like that Aiden was just like, you know what? I'm done. Yeah. yeah. Peace you know, out. Peace like, out. Like, I think, I think there needed to be some sort of closure, I guess, mm-hmm. with that so mm-hmm. that it didn't keep... Because, I mean... You've already reached the highest point yeah, in right. like beating them up. So right. like, what else are you gonna do? Like, the next step would be right. to kill them. But right. I don't, you know, I can do that. I can but do that. no, yeah. I don't think Clyde is gonna do that. But I want to know what this henchman found. Yeah, I know. Yeah. But now I'm excited. Now I want to know. Like yeah. now, I'm like the, really. I want to know. Yeah. <laughs> you want to know too, girl? <laughs> no. Just no. I have to agree that Days did have that feel for me back when I first started watching it. Um, and it was it was weird because it it did, it did come along on Wednesday mm-hmm. where Wednesday. I was just kind of like. This days is kind of familiar to me. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it was funny. It, it was, was a definite change. Yeah, you could definitely change. tell a change in the writing. Like I was, like I was just kind of like, like the <clears> episodes <throat> were. I was like, oh my god, the episode's already done. Like instead what? of like, did you notice a difference? Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can. I can definitely tell you. I noticed yeah. a difference. Yeah. 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 No, no more elephant talk. Next week. <laughs> next week it will be different. Next, yeah. week, next week is a surefire difference. Yeah. 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 But you're right. Tune it's just in. a difference. Yeah. <laughs> Some of you can. Well, you can tell, and you can tell already from the the teasers and stuff. Like yeah. I see the teasers now, and I'm like, oh. Whereas before, I was just like. Oh, yeah, we knew that was going to happen. You know what I mean? Like, it was like, oh, new stuff. Like, there's actually going to be different stuff. It's not going to be... But the fact that they're showcasing veterans just kicked this off. Mm -hmm. And Hope is a veteran of the show. Out of everybody, she is a veteran of the show. And I thought that was really great to do that. Yeah, we know you like Hope. Um, I love you. I love you, Kristen Alfonso. (laughs) So your your, your Wi-Fi is working. You can't see the chat. Mm -hmm. Okay, so some of the things that uh, people are are saying in the chat is, I was happy to see Bo and Hope's house, which I thought the same thing. Yes, I was thinking the same thing, too. Um, too. Someone said, uh, Willa says, uh, Willa Sargent says, Aiden is a bad guy. Um, Daquan says, they're probably going to make it that Aiden really did kill his wife. Oh. Um, oh. I think he's going to get killed. Who? Mm. Aiden. Aiden. Really? Mm. Really? Yeah. He's such a great actor. Oh, Darren yeah. yeah. Cavsgrove yeah. is so good. Every, think, every show he's so. on, he's good. He's so good. Um, I think so. Jess J says, I had tears when they showed Bope's house. Just oh. wish Aiden and Clyde well, hadn't been there. I had they tears, the, too. The front door and the bedroom, which was like I the side of the closet. Too. Yeah. <laughs> when she said fancy face, I was like, oh my god! Anyway. Actually, you know what? When they See? showed the clip of Patch, uh-huh. the, the clip yes. of the teaser, mm-hmm. and he's like, he's like, he says about sweetness, and yes. I was like, oh my god! 
Sí, sí, sí. No, I'm not putting yes. it down by any means. I'm, I'm happy. It. I'm excited. Um, all right. So, I mean, that's pretty much yeah, it with that, that storyline. Story right? so now we're going to see what happens. I mean, it's, it's very exciting. Yeah. Um, well, in other news, <laughs> in other Salem news, uh, so we have J.J. Page and Kyle. Now, first of all, J.J., please stop sneaking into this man's house. I, I know. Like... How many? Okay, first of all, if you are going to sneak into someone's house, not that I have, so don't take what I'm about to say <laughs> okay. to heart. Okay. Have a plan. Yes. Like, know what you're going Maybe in for, tomorrow. know what you're going to do, do it really quick, and then leave. JJ goes in and he's like, okay, I got to find something. Well, what you looking for? Like <laughs> An elephant. <laughs> We needed to play. What we should have done this. We should have done a drinking game while she's here. How many times? Every time we say elephant, <laughs> elephant. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. we had to take a drink. Next time. Right. Next, next time. Out. Next well. time. Um, <laughs> yeah. Right. Yes. So, but it's like it's like he he goes in and he's he's so gung ho about taking down Kyle now, and it's like mm-hmm. when you signed up for this, you should have known that it's gonna take a little bit. Like you're not gonna join him and be like, hey, I'm your drug dealer now, and yeah. then by tomorrow he's in jail. Like it's yeah. not gonna happen yeah um but i did find it interesting that um uh once again Paige is like trying to convince jen jennifer that yes. you know jj's dealing and look out and blah blah, yeah. blah and then she goes to work at uh the yogurt place yes. which <laughs> your place they've added an extra table so <laughs> they are open <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. they're surviving they're okay. yes. Yes. the yogurt yes uh no i've had a scene with yogurt but i don't know if i actually uh, had it uh, you know I what i know what happened i've had a scene with yogurt too never had it just sitting outside waiting <laughs> waiting yeah. Yeah. just waiting yeah. Yeah. just waiting yeah. They don't have store hours or anything, but you know they're there, yeah. mm-hmm. day it's and good. night. Yeah, day and night. yeah, it's, it's good. good. It yeah. looks good. Yeah, yeah, but I've never, no. I've never had it. No. no. Um, but I found it interesting that Jay, when uh, they all meet up in the Horton Town Square, JJ was just basically like, you know, you're gonna end up in jail unless you drop her, and then turn the whole thing on Paige to yeah. kind of make it make Kyle trust him a little bit more. Mm-hmm. But then there's Paige being like, oh, uh, JJ is bad, you know, blah, blah, blah. Unless you both are bashing each other. Like, what's going My on? My thing was, right. it's funny, because I'm an organizer by trade, and so I look at Kyle's apartment, which he's a young man, a drug dealer. It's very organized. Well, he needs to be. He needs to be able to grab the coke <laughs> and go. <laughs> exactly, mm-hmm. and the money, I mean, whatever. just because you're a drug dealer doesn't mean you're a drug addict. <laughs> yeah. you know that's that's true. That's very true. That yes, that's very true. true. Wise words from yes. us, Archer. <laughs> see, <laughs> see, it, had Drugs are bad. <laughs> <laughs> See, had Serena been working with Kyle, she would have been a bit more Ooh, organized. Yeah. I know. <laughs> <laughs> she was all over the place. I mean, her hotel room was clean, but thank God for maid service. <laughs> thank God for, yeah, maid, I'll say maid service did that one for you. Yeah. But I just thought it was funny. I mean, the reason I bring it up is kind of funny because JD is barging in there, moving stuff. Like, he will know if something's missing or moved. Yes, yes. Because yeah. it's so neat. Well, just as, you know, okay, when Paige, when oh, they got yeah. back to the, to the apartment and Paige goes in, first of all, she didn't use no key. Mm. Oh, that's right. That's Didn't true. use a key at all. No, yes. Like she was Who's handed. Apartment? Uh, Kyle's, Kyle's apartment. Kyle's apartment. She just like, walked in. She was handed a key, and he was like, "Oh, I have to take this call. Go ahead and go in." And she was like, "Okay." And she was like. And I'm like, whoa, girlfriend, wait a minute. Like, when I'm at my door, I'm like, oh, my God, which key is it? I have two locks. Oh, my God, is this the right? And then, you know, so he would, JJ would have had plenty enough time to go hide. But she walks in, and he has this look of like, oh, my God. Like, I just got caught doing the nasty with your your mother. mother. (laughs) Oh, my God, that was so perfect. (laughs) (laughs) So we sit together so much, we're twins. At this point. Um, but I like that Paige helped him. She did, actually. I was shocked. I was, too, because she's been angry, Paige. Ooh, she's been mm. angry. I mean, I would be, too. She's been yeah. real angry. Yeah. Like, real angry. <laughs> well, she's not like, I mean, did you see what her mom did? Yeah. Like, with yeah, her boyfriend? Yeah, yeah. I mean, but, you know, after some time, it's Salem. After you get some over time. it. You get over it. <laughs> You no. get over it. You know. At, at no. what point do you just say, you know what? I it's give up. cool. Yeah. No. It's cool. It's not cool. <laughs> well, wait, was she a virgin? I forget. Yes. Yes. Oh, okay. Well, it's sort of okay then. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right? Because well, it's not like, you know, you had this and then you had that. You yeah, know, it's yeah. Like, it's yeah. like, you, you ain't going to get this anymore. You know? <laughs> yeah, <exactly. laughs> or ever. <laughs> um, I'm going to give it to Kyle. <laughs> You're right. Who's the You don't mean me, by the way. Yeah, not <laughs> you. Yeah, not, not Melissa. <laughs> the character. 
I love how I love how there has to be different. We have to differentiate yeah. Like, yeah. between yeah. Melissa and, and Serena. Yeah, yeah, because subject. you don't want to be at Rouse and someone's like, "How dare you?" <laughs> yeah. And then, yeah, you don't want that to happen. That would be awful. Or to be in Target. Or it could be kind of fun. I don't know. <laughs> Depends. I might, I might love that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Just kidding. I'm just, just kidding. kidding. She's just kidding. Or to be in Target. Can you imagine if you're in Target and someone like hands you an elephant and goes, "I got the diamonds you've been." Actually, please do this. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm like, me too. I'm like, give me enough of a diamonds. I'll look at it too, right. Um, So, fans, if you ever see Melissa (laughs) in Target... Go to the ceramics aisle. There is a there's an elephant there. <laughs> Casually walk up to her, look around, and go. I've got the diamonds you've been looking for. Ooh, I love it when you whisper. You're welcome. Nice. I'm I'm in the chat so on my sexy. phone. I don't know why my phone works, but not. Okay, good. Okay. And now oh, we can hey, see I us. Can see I know. I have to cover the top. Oh no! I want to <laughs> <do that. laughs> I'm also am I on am I on camera? Here, I'm on camera. Oh, camera. <laughs> oh, I love Mark. I love that. See, I got in just in time. Oh, just in time. Jeez. <laughs> um, um, somebody did say they. Uh, I think it was Daquan actually. Mm-hmm. Daquan. He loves you, by the way. Yeah. Oh, um, he's very. He said he's jealous of you because you got to meet Melissa and Michael uh, R something. Michael. Far. Rosenbaum. Yeah, he was yes, jealous. Of I got because Mike Rosenbaum. I do another show on After Buzz TV called and Pastor, and he held me on camera. Mm-hmm. So I'm very happy. Thank you, Daquan. Y'all are so gushy. Mm-hmm. Who? Me, me and him. Mm-hmm. Well, thank you, we're all doing it now. Not me. You're not you. Um, do I need to put the picture <laughs> back up? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 Just say <laughs> So if you want to say hi to Daquan, even though me and Daquan have a hate hate relationship. Hey Daquan. <laughs> hey, Daquan, Daquan, I'll make that into a gift for you too. Exactly, <laughs> totally, yeah, totally. He's one of our regulars, so yeah. he's great. He's great. He, um, but yes, this storyline. This storyline was actually one of my least favorites this week. It was like, yeah. Oh, the JJ Page. Yeah, JJ Page. It's like, yeah, that's fine. Um, they, they're all doing whatever and. They're just trying to get rid of Kyle. And yeah, Kyle I really wish they would stop talking out loud. Yeah, I know. Because that little area of like off to the Horton Town Square mm-hmm. where people tend to the have conversations. Private square or yeah, private the private little private area. The edge of the, I don't know. Yeah, mm-hmm. like you know, people can still hear you, and mm-hmm. people yeah. you know yeah. tend to walk up just as Paige did when uh, she walked up and was like, "JJ, what's going on?" Because he heard, she overheard that he's working with the DEA. Yeah. But, like, isn't that the thing with soaps is there's always someone lurking around the corner. Right. Mm-hmm. And they can always hear. Right. Mm-hmm. I did that a long time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you did a lot of lurking? So, so. No. Oh, a lot of lurking. A lot of lurking. You know who's like, not lurking? Hallways. Hashtag Maxine Sun. <laughs> I could be lurking around listening to some things. That could be a, a drinking game, to too. Happen. Every time Tony says <laughs> <laughs> or every time I mention Billy Flynn. <laughs> we would be drunk if you... If we wouldn't every, get through a show. We wouldn't. They'd be like, Billy Flynn, Billy Flynn. <laughs> I'm done. I have nothing else to drink. Uh, um, so I'm interested to see how... Oh, oh God. Um, it relate, in related news, mm-hmm. Roxanne's on Twitter now. Is she really? Yes. Yes. She is. An- yeah. Andre- Andriana Manfredi, I do believe, was her. And I think that's oh. her Twitter is Andriana Oh, that's great. Yeah. So I'm going to We want her back on the show. We bring back, back show. Roxanne. Mm-hmm. Back, back, Roxanne. We I liked her. her. I really feel like we should start singing. Roxanne. <laughs> 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 red light. There we go. I said this to you guys after we talked to you last Sunday, after our After Buzz, after... After, after. After, after. Uh, after we walked away from you, I said, I can't wait for Melissa. I think it's going to be a really fun after Buzz. Oh, oh yeah. I was, I was ready. I was like, I'm homegirls ready. Homegirls. I mean, I don't ready. Ready. Don't I don't say that. You say bitch. You say bitch. That's oh, okay, fine. Yeah. Just that. a female dog. It's a female yeah. dog. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, so, yeah. So, I, I, I mean, it we'll, we'll, we'll I see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see what happens. He's going to yell at you them. keep looking at it. No, no, no. Okay, okay, I'll stop. I'll stop. Well, well, he see. yells at me. I don't know if he'll yell at you. No, I would never yell at you. Not at Melissa. <laughs> <laughs> I am so in love right now. <laughs> see, how the, see, this face is just very attentive. Yeah. I, like I don't know. I, I think like Billy that. would disagree. Yeah. Billy. Well, I don't know. I felt that was very special for me. <laughs> She's all hello. Yeah. All right. So uh, let's uh, travel over to uh, the Wilson Paulson. Yes. 
<laughs> oh, me. Sorry, I was. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> We're giving you cues. I, okay, giving you cues. I have a hard enough time reading it on my laptop. My eyes right now are just like, <laughs> what is going on? Um, yeah. So then we had. Uh, so uh, Sunny left. Suddenly got a job in Paris. Apparently had the offer. Had the, has had the offer pending for a while. We just didn't know about it. Um, <laughs> I think the, I think that was a two shot on us. That no one saw that. Tony, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> Note to self, do not eat pizza rolls live on camera. Or wait until the, where the camera's over here, so no, you're fine. Good. Um, even though I called you out on it. But, yeah, uh, yeah so we find out that Victor had offered Sonny the job in Paris to go. Nice which I think is hysterical that he's going to save these clubs in Paris. Right. But if I'm not mistaken... TBD had some difficulties. Yes, also had some money <laughs> several, financial. Several months back yeah. that he was like trying to get money to save right. TBD. Well, so I don't know if he's the best person to send to Paris. Apparently to TBD is okay. They have an extra table. You're doing good when you have an extra table. <laughs> you got a table. You're doing good. Yes. Yeah. I like the table that's up on the cart. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. like my favorite table. But I always want to sit at it. I know it's kind of dangerous, but I was like, yeah, I sit there. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't sit on it. So, I mean, so I Sunny, so oh, Sunny so left. I can see it. It's raised on yeah. 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 So Sunny left. I can't believe that. He's gone. Yeah. Very well, he abruptly. did say in an interview he's not opposed to returning. Right. Already, he said that. Well, that's good. So, We're not opposed to having him here at AfterBuzz. What a We're great, not. what a great. I know Issa so is. Oh, yeah. Bo- Chomping at the bit to get him here. Yes, we're going to hold Speaking it. of Issa, we should we should totally give oh. her a shout oh, out. Oh, should I grab it? You want to grab it? Yeah. Okay. yeah. We have such, you guys are such loyal fans and such wonderful fans that we actually have uh, one of our big fans from Paris. Oh, nice. From France. Made up a poem about us using Audition Day's letters. Aww. And then also sent us via mail, made mugs for each of us. That's uh, so cool. That great, and each mug it? has our name on our picture. Yeah. So th- thank you so much. It was such a great, nice thing for you to do. Thank you. Isa. We really appreciate it. Open to the presentation hands. I know. I like that. <laughs> but no, but it's, I mean, I'm mean, seriously. I, mean, I, I have never had anything. Show them put, 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 so they can see me. Put me into. Oh thing. my god. <laughs> Thank you so much. Anyway, so one. yes, so it was very. I thought nice he was going to drink his coffee in the morning. He's going to have one finger <laughs> on my face and drink his coffee. Well, we, we really appreciate it. We and it has all four of us. It has all, it four, does. all yeah. four. It's all four of us. So yeah, but we really appreciate it. And also, you guys are so great, and we just appreciate all your love. Thank you, guys. Yes. And those of you who like my laugh, thank you very much. Your laugh's awesome. I've, it's been very polarizing recently online. Oh, <laughs> Those of my other shows, we were like, uh, my ears are read, bleeding. Don't read what they I said. Know, I, I know. Have you guys ever heard me laugh? <laughs> Dear like, Lord, I'm a cackle. I'm like, <laughs> 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 oh no, I'm fine with it. It just makes me laugh. It's been been mentioned. Um, but actually, so back to that storyline. He left, and yeah. now we have just Will sitting there. What's gonna happen with Will next? Will and Paul. And Paul, they both just and a Will or Derek. But I, I actually What's felt. <laughs> Like, he didn't. He actually didn't know what to do because right. as he started talking uh, to uh, little Ari, yeah. uh, he was just like, "Right," and I was like, "Say something! <laughs> 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 Say something! <laughs> Say something to her, please!" And the thing is, I love that because Ari and Sonny had a relationship. I mean, he delivered yeah. her, obviously, yeah. yes. and he was very much a dad yes. to her. Oh, uh, that was and him saying goodbye to Ari. Oh, was I was the yeah, sweetest I, scene, I, I the agree. sweetest thing. Even though the actress Ari didn't have <laughs> him back, which I thought was hysterical, yeah. but it was still sweet. <laughs> that was funny. She's like, funny. <laughs> <laughs> I know, kid actors, but it was still sweet. It was well, still sweet. <laughs> I, I really think the sweetest moment was uh, Paul and Sunny. That was a good one too. Yeah, that was a I, good one too. I, I think that. W- and I like that the writers let us know as fans that yes, they did have feelings for each other. Yes, yeah. I agree. And, and well, so I, don't think I like that. Doubted moment. that. Well, they, 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 well they, we weren't sure. You never know. Days could be like, oh yeah, they got proposed no, they know. to him. Why would he propose? If he that was back. Him? That was back then. We're talking oh, you're about talking about now. Yeah, so, so, yeah, no, saying now. Saying they still have feelings for each other. Got it. Got it. Got it. You left out the word still. Ooh. Oh. Oh. That's my argument. He said that's my argument. I'll be on that one. Right. Thank you. Um, Tony, I know you I know you wanted to throw some shade after you said all four of us. I saw your expression. <laughs> Ooh, rude. I don't throw shade. What does that mean? Shade? Uh-huh. Uh, it's kind of like yeah, I like know, attitude. I, so. mm-hmm. yeah. I thought you would know that, especially yeah. just like shade. It's kinda of like attitude. Yeah. Like like if you walked in and I was like, oh, hey Melissa. Like when I carry my parasol, I'm covered in shade. <laughs> 
Oh my god. I think that's what I figured it meant. Right, right. Yeah. Exactly. Okay, good. Um, <laughs> now we're all on the same page. <laughs> I, I really thought it was just an abrupt exit for, was. for Sunny. It was. But um, I'm glad there was like a little bit of closure. Now I'm just wondering what's going to happen with, with Sunny, I mean, with Will and Will. Paul. Will and Paul. Oh, this, is, this is what I. I'm hoping that they don't do with the new writing. I hope okay. they don't get rid of the gay storyline. Yeah, yeah, because I thought right. that exact same yeah, thing. Because too. I, I actually thought the exact same thing. I just feel like, you know, when when Will was first discovering who he was and being gay and like like they they did all of that so well to Beautifully. ease this very conservative okay. soap mm-hmm. into oh, that yeah, idea. Right, right. And I feel like they now have developed these characters and you know we have a love for these characters. So I hope they don't just go. Nah, we're done. Did M- you okay. did you happen to notice? And I I don't know if this is related news, but did you happen to notice that when John was talking to Marlena and he mentioned his kids, he did not mention Paul. He said Brady and Bell, and I he did, did not that. say Paul. I did mention that. You hear that? Oh. And I, as soon as I heard that, I was like, oh, are they going to say that it's not his son? Are they going to get rid of Paul? That was my very first thought. Well, you know, everything that. can happen with just a phone call. I know. Right. I know. I know. The one thing I liked about the whole gay storyline was that it was more than a gay storyline. Yeah. They treated it like a soap storyline. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, it was like all the twists and turns and the angst and all that. Yeah. You could insert it. Which is a gay women. <laughs> well, I know. Really, I know. <laughs> But it's your life on a weekend. FYI, I guess. Yeah, it's, it's like, that's it's a right. Tuesday afternoon <laughs> right. at my house. <laughs> yeah. But you know what I mean? It's like it, was, it was actually all the kind of stuff that went through it. It could yeah. have been insert a female. It could insert. A, I mean, mm-hmm. it just—it was really. I think. They, I think they treated so well. And you know Plus, what? I also too. I liked, and I did. It, surprisingly, I liked the fact that there was that moment where Will went back to Gabby and then ended up getting mm-hmm. her pregnant. Obviously. Um, at first, I was kind of like, ah, uh, but then I was like, no, it kind of, I could totally yeah. see something like that happening, mm-hmm. especially if you're on the fence and you're, you know, questioning, you want to say, oh, okay, no, I can do this, this is who I want to mm-hmm. be, and blah, blah, blah. Mm-hmm. I never did that. Don't you worry, fret none. Um, <laughs> but, <laughs> uh, I but yeah, I, I actually enjoyed that. I, I just, yeah, I agree. I think that yeah. it was a good, yeah. and I hope that they don't get rid of it. Same here. I hope they don't, but uh, <laughs> let's, I mean, let's, let's hope. <laughs> I'm sorry. That corn really bothers Tony a lot. Yeah, I know. Um, he's always like... Let's hope that, uh, I don't know, Will learns from this. Yep. Will Sammy Jr. That mm-hmm. Sammy Jr. You That's can't right. continue doing And I love that they pointed out all the stuff that he's done. Oh, yeah. Oh, and and that, was the like, that was the yeah. last week, list. though, wasn't it? No, that was, no, this, that was this, this week. week. It was a laundry list. You probably uh, yeah. get pizza rolls. That happened. probably was. Yes. No. Um... Well, what was was it? Yeah, I guess it was this week. Yeah, yeah. when when Sunny yeah. Sunny was like, week. you get this because Sunny said yeah, something, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then even yeah. Paul okay. was just like, how many more times are you going to be sorry right. for yeah. all the stuff that you've right. done? Yeah, no, yeah. that was great. He was think. red. He Serena, was red. How many more times Serena. are you going to be sorry about all the stuff I'm that really you've done? I'm really not sorry. <laughs> 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 You're like, I did it. So there. I did it. What? I did yeah. that. Life's all Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. So sorry, oh, sorry. I was reading the chat. let's uh, let's hope that they don't you know get rid of of uh, that storyline. Anything in the chat uh, that you want to bring up, Mark? Um, I got it, Kayla. I don't know what that means. This is oh, I can't read this. Can I read it for you? <laughs> yes, I need more father son bonding. Paul, and again, Will is not Sammy Junior. Oh, oh Daquan's gonna be so happy you're reading his. That's Cheryl Daquan. said it was oh, when he was in the ISA. <laughs> met Marlena, had Brady and Bell. That's why there was no mention of Paul. Why was it not? Or he did say that because when when John and Marlena were talking about John's time in the ISA, and when he first met Marlena and had Brady and Bell, mm-hmm. that's why there was no mention of Paul. Yeah, he but was, he said his kids. But he was talking about that, that time. time. Uh, I, don't, I don't know. I still think it's kind of shady. Yeah. Well, it's mentioned. possible. It's totally possible. Like shady or like throwing shade? <laughs> like shady. Shady. Oh, okay. shady. 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 I'm always talking about the parasol. Yeah. Just check. <laughs> this is important clarification. It is. Yes. It is. It is. Um, so real quick, just some tidbits yes. that happened. Uh, Jennifer and Eve once again had a run-in. Um, Julie convinced Eve to help... Uh, uh, Jennifer out with the Horton Town yes. Center. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wait, is that is that what it's called? Yeah, yeah no, Horton t- the Horton. Well, no, it's um, oh, the, Horton. the Horton Center. Horton, 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 Horton Town Center. Square. Horton Town Square. Well, no, it's Wait, the no? Horton no, the Center. Rehabilitation for, for, Center or something. Yeah, oh, yeah. That, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 Um, where you know Serena doesn't have to worry about no. going. Someone in, in the chat should good. write it in there. Yeah. What's the name of it? Cheryl. Cheryl. Yeah. Cheryl. Come on, Cheryl. Tell us um, but, but yeah, so yeah, Julie. Somebody agrees with, with me. I don't know what they agree with, but somebody agrees with me. <laughs> oh my god. What was funny <laughs> about? Oh, what was funny is um, I don't know that. You know, Eve has a bug uh, in the house apparently. What? Yeah, she's. So she's yeah, well, that's why she took the check over. 
You did, yeah, yeah, there you go. Serena did that. That's yeah. <laughs> Serena, Serena did that. Clyde did that. Oh, yeah. Now Eve has done it. Yeah, that's true. We're very rich. Yeah, yeah. Y'all are some very rich people. And Clyde's is technically and is a really good spy still store in, the, in Salem. <laughs> Salem in the Demira Mansion, is yeah, it not? Yeah, yeah. I mean, okay. he hasn't been over there to get it. No, no he hasn't. Just sitting there. So, but so no, not the you. town square, guys. We're the name that of the fault, place that, that they're trying to <laughs> Horton no, Horton House. No, it's not the Horton House. Hey guys, come on. We're holding. No. We're, we need you for well, this. Anyway. Well, anyway. Yeah, the, the, <laughs> like, soon as like, yeah. well, anyway, yeah. back to me. I guarantee it'll be Cheryl that'll have the right name. But no, it's just kind of, it's just kind of funny <laughs> that Eve's Cheryl. listening in. I'm really curious. Who, she's trying to destroy Jen, but I don't know if I like this storyline so much. I'm kind of seeing it's not really gelling for me. So I'm really curious to see what. I just feel like they don't know what to do with Eve, and like she keeps right. having this whole vendetta yeah. on like JJ and not being able to talk to Paige. Right. And I'm like, work on that relationship uh, before you try to scheme on something else. Because so we're saying Horton House of Abused Women. No. I don't, I don't think it was that either. I feel like it was called something else too. Yeah. Yeah. I, just feel like, I just feel like Cassie DePaiva is such an, a, a phenomenal actress. She's amazing. That yeah. she should be getting, I mean, come yeah. on. Yeah. I mean, she Her and Serena have, should have had more scenes. I'm like, that's fine. Okay. Well, I know, I mean, it's been so funny for us. O- OLT. The Horton yes. Center. So well, Center. we always felt like that about, about you, just, you know, you being <laughs> we did such a brilliant actress that, yeah. like, I don't. We don't feel like uh, they utilized you as much as they could have. Yeah. I think everybody agrees with that 100%. Yeah. I've yeah. said on the show many times. 100%. Thank you. Everybody like, in the chat room would always say yeah, that. Yeah, they would say that. Think that, that she's a great actress. Like, come on. Like, let's, yeah. come on. Let's give Red some more work. Yeah. What's going yeah. On? So, yes. Okay, well, at least so. we did learn one thing from seeing that Serena dies. She's at least not the serial killer. Oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, I'm okay, first death scene. I hope, I hope that I live up to my death. <laughs> I'm really excited about it. That and, and you had a great slapping scene. They say they foretold Ooh, yeah. a slap. Oh, no, that whole like day Ooh. is going to be so great. Yeah. Oh, I can't wait. He's going to love it. Uh, oh, no, I do. Oh, good, yeah, good. <laughs> oh, my God, your man, my girl. Mm-hmm. We work it out. Mm-hmm. Oh, I love it. I don't know if he's technically my man. Man. But what so, I mean, <laughs> whatever. I mean, maybe. Not, I mean, we're never know. not talking about it. I mean, he is straight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he is. Um, so, so we don't want to go on to like. Uh who are we going to next? Rafe. I mean, Rafe. Just okay. Rafe, really quick. He loves hope. Everyone's starting to realize it. Yeah. Done. yeah. Done. Oh, and also he's thinking about joining the oh, yes. Salem PD. Yeah, yeah, yeah. John talked to come into it. Whose planner was that? I missed that. I, John's. John's. That's what I thought. Yeah. Okay. It said last day. Yeah, yeah, Salem PD, PD. Question mark. Question mark. <laughs> There was a question mark, yes. There was a question mark. There was a question mark. Well, well, you know what the question mark was for? The Salem PD, because they can't ever seem to solve a case. (laughs) Uh, Uh, Well, yeah. Salem PD, question mark? (laughs) Yeah. Sure says it is the Horton Center. Is the Horton Center. And I believe Cheryl. Okay. I believe her too, actually, so sure, Cheryl, if you say so. Um, John and Marlena had some There was a lot of John and Marlena. Yes. Yes. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Yes. Yes. I, I thought that that... To bring it back to what King Corday said in Soap Opera Digest, mm-hmm. um, that it's all about the super couples. I yes. thought that was a great way to introduce introduce the super the couple, couple. I agree. Right. and get it back on track to like where is our relationship? I agree. Yeah, you know I agree. I mean? yeah. Although he wasn't quite ready, uh, Marlena wasn't ready to have John in she her bed. No, she okay. was not. But she, I mean, sometimes you gotta take it slow. But I mean, they listen. They have been together <laughs> for like years. decades. Yeah, all this right. is still a familiar man. Even back when he was 10 different people, that was still a familiar man. When he okay. was 10 different people. <laughs> okay, I have to say this one quote. I hope this is not your quote of the week, Mark, because no, it's I just uh, my job right Because I thought this was very smooth. I might use this on a date one day. Ooh. John to Marlena. I don't want this night to end. Well, what do you want to do? I want to take you to a slow walk through the park to your house. Mm-hmm. If I play my cards right. I'll be right next to you when you wake up in the morning. Oh, <laughs> he said that I was like, what? I was like, Drake Hogan said, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm ready too now. And Marlena looked back at him like, you ain't getting, you ain't getting uh, this. You're never going to get it now. We can go through the uh-uh. park, but you ain't going to be in my house. They need to put her, they need to put that penthouse set back to Oh my God, no, totally. He needs to her more. I get it. That's fine. Yeah. They're showing yeah. romance. I mean, yeah. like, they clo- uh, they clo- got that. that you can tell that, that it's already yeah. getting, I mean, just the Victor and Caroline. I know. Hope and nice. talking about Rafe and stuff yeah. and Aiden and then uh, uh, John and Marlena, <laughs> you know, I just yeah. can't. Yeah. Name just keeps At least it's not because she used to be a priest. Right. Right. I mean, which would be impossible because yeah. the priest time. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I 
love the whole love in the afternoon. That's what soaps were about back yes. in the day. Yes. Love in the afternoon. But I'm, I'm, here's my worry, uh -oh, though, too. Uh -oh. Oh, here we go. Because I do have a concern. Just because I had a little difficulty this week oh. with my quote of the week. And I'm like, <gasps> oh, if I don't get my that? snarky, uh -oh. I'm going to be very upset. Because I live for the snarky. There wasn't a lot of snarky. There was this week. I was going to have to use your viral. <laughs> I mean, that's okay. Yeah, that's totally right. <laughs> because I was like, oh. But, was I no mean, there were some. Actually, you know who had a lot of great lines this week? He's not my quote of the week, but uh, was Rafe. Yeah, he, he did. He had a lot yeah. of. Mm -hmm. um, he <laughs> when uh, Hope comes in and they're arguing, and he's she says something about a file, and he's like. A file, Hope. Really? You're reaching. <laughs> <laughs> I literally busted out laughing on my bed. I was like, thank you. Yes, thank right, you right, for pointing right. out the absurdity yes, of that. Exactly. And then when he called uh, Clyde, uh, he's our very own hillbilly <laughs> hero. Yes. And he, and he so also, he had a lot of good and he, also, and he also went to, said, you know, Clyde goes, yeah, I should have came to you, talk to you man to man. He goes, man to what? Yeah. Oh, I mean, this and he had. said something about dis he he wanted a drink, and he's like, oh, I'm out of disinfectant. Yeah, so, like yeah. so oh, Rafe's had, had a yeah. lot of, like, yeah. I was like, what? Rafe's going to be. Rafe was a little sassy. He was a little sassy. Yeah. I love yeah. that. Yeah. Thank you. So, oh, Rafe. Um, and then Victor and Caroline had a touching have. moment. Yeah. So that, that was, was good. really sweet. And the email I, with the doctor yeah. that we found out that Victor's been. Yes. Mm -hmm. I actually got a little teary eyed actually um, yeah. when he was when they were talking and also when Maggie and Caroline talked because I'm like there's a little triangle kind of maybe coming up with that I yeah. was wondering that yeah. I had a feeling because when that. when because when Caroline when when Victor came out of the room and hugged and they were Maggie and they were talking he's like I only have eyes for you Bob and he hug her face was kind of like. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But then when Maggie, when, then when Caroline's like, "Can you come in here, Maggie? I'm gonna talk to you, Maggie." And she walks in. Okay, no, she yelled from oh, the yes. <laughs> Maggie, <laughs> Maggie, <laughs> Maggie, is that you yeah, out there? there? Yeah. Can I talk to you in here, Maggie? Oh, girl, get it together. It is a hospital. She did yell. She did yell. But yeah. like, but it was touching when it got together. But Caroline has no qualms. She's like, "I'm, we own this." Yeah, yeah. yeah. Come yeah here. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. But I, I thought that all that was so touching. Played on history. Mm -hmm. We talked about Bo again. It's setting up Bo again. It's setting up. Talk yeah. about saying that, that Caroline and Victor are worried about him. That's their mm -hmm. child. I mean, it's just like, I think a triangle's coming though there with that. Yeah, right? I, I, I would love that. Cool. That'd be I would very love cool. Yeah. I would love that also. I would love that because no one's bad. I love no. all three of them. Yeah, yeah. and especially yeah. since Maggie is so understanding of Victor yeah. and Caroline. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. So yeah, it's yeah. just kind of like. But he's lying to her right now. He's not, yeah. he's not, he's yeah. not saying anything. He closed he well, but he's yes. always kind of always been lying. And we talked about yeah. this actually mm -hmm. last week a little bit, that he's always kind of keeping stuff from... I mean, not that he wouldn't keep it from Caroline, too. Right, <laughs> from right, Caroline, right. but that's just the nature of Victor, yeah. you know? Yeah. That he can't really I tell I mean, going them. back, like, a week, I just want to say, did you see how Victor, like, like forgave me? I don't know if he forgave me, but he was nice to me. Yeah. Well, and you, you almost so got my quote of the week, too, when, he, when oh, he was yeah. like, I've only heard bad things about you, and you were like, um, I could say the same to you. <laughs> <laughs> I know, he did, say that. he did say it last week. He just said that was almost yeah. a quote. Yeah. Anyway, sorry, I just had to throw that in. No, 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 that's, <laughs> good. no that's good to throw in. That's good to throw in. All right, so let's get to our favorite part of the show, which are our segments. Oh, I thought Billy was coming back. <laughs> oh, God. Like, oh that God. would be your favorite part of the show? <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Um, so we're going to start, kick off our segments as usual with mine, and it's the Three Snaps Award. Now, uh, I thought about this long and hard. Oh, ooh. Ooh, wow. Nice. Oh. Thank you. But it, they're more slower. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, that was good. You gotta add that. that sound, I want a sound effect for mine, Stephen. Get something together. Oh boy. <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good one. I like that. That's a good one. I like that. That's a good one. So my three snaps award goes to the Phoenix, who has finally risen, like for real, for real. Oh, risen. We actually saw Stefano Demera standing <laughs> during a scene. He was not sitting. He was not conducting. He, he was, was standing. standing upright. I almost put him Now granted, <laughs> now granted, granted, he didn't move. No, he didn't. There was no walking. Oh but God. he stood firmly in that doorway. <laughs> In his defense, I do think he hurt his back really bad. I think oh, so. Oh, he did? Yeah, oh, okay. a while ago. I, yeah. Oh, kind of great. Well, wait, laughing, well, way to kill my face. <laughs> <episode. laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Once again, maybe well, he, hey, maybe he's starting to feel better. Well, okay, and well so that's there good. Three that's snaps good. To that. Good, oh, good. Oh, oh, she's not. Well, there you snapped. go. You did. Snapped. You did. Well, Stefano gets you. my official three snaps award for now conducting a scene. Of standing right. Erect. 
<laughs> Let me see. Now, right. I, now I feel bad because don't now, feel bad. Well, when, that, when, that, when that was going to look like you know I have something towards the elderly because I gave <laughs> because I gave the three stamps award oh. to Carolyn for her headaches and then the next week it was like I had a stroke and I was like. <laughs> Because Carolyn was like mean to you, she was like, "Serena, yeah, yeah. I don't have time for you right well, now. My well, head hurts." I gave it, I gave it to Carolyn because uh, because when she was with Teresa and and uh, uh, Brady, yeah. she was like, "Oh, I have a headache." Now, have Teresa to, and uh, Anne. And Anne, yeah. Teresa yeah. and Anne. Uh, she was like, oh, I have a headache. I have to go. Like, I can't really do this. I can't even this. listen to this. I right. got it. Yeah. 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 And then she went to the private area, and then here you come with, like, the letter, and she was just like, oh, really? You know, I, someone's going to get my medicine. Oh, I can't. That's uh, right. And yeah, then, I thought it was. No. Yeah, and, then, right. and then all of a sudden, she was just like, you're still talking. I'm just going to fall out. <laughs> she, did, she did, too. She was like, okay, enough. She was like, enough. She was like, I was trying to tell you I got a headache. I don't feel like dealing with this. And you're still talking. Okay, well, fine. Because you were like, I got a letter to give to Eric. A letter. It's important. It's important. Yeah. It, well, you know what's important? Her. Because yes. she was like, I don't want to go. listen to you. Yeah, I gotta that's go. Gotta go. Yeah. Okay, yeah. That's so, now, so now I have something against her. <laughs> that's really yeah, great. Yeah, that's, oh, great. Well, that's a good one. You gave snaps. That's good. Well, that's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said earlier, too, when um, Alice, when she was her last oh, yeah, they month on the show, they wheeled yeah. her it, was, it was, I'm sorry, it was funny because instead of, like, she'd stop talking, and instead of her leaving the scene, everybody would just walk away. And I gotta say, I mean, it was, I mean, you know, I get it. She was nice on her. Time, but oh, I'm sorry. Goodness. Every time it would happen, I was just like, "Sweet Jesus!" Oh, <laughs> <my God. laughs> Oh, All right, so uh, uh, how do I follow that? Well, I don't know, but you're going to tell us you who's you're related here in Salem. Okay, so what I do is, as you guys know, I take two characters who are on the show, or sometimes characters from the past that are on, and show you how they're related, because sometimes family trees get convoluted, and mm. and you don't know who's who and who's whom, and sometimes you forget. So in honor of Sunny leaving, I decided to pick two characters who are related, you may have forgotten. One is coming on the show shortly, and the other one has just left. Jackson, Sonny Kiriakis, and Claire Brady. Oh, Her yeah. name is Olivia Rose Keegan. She's going to be playing Claire Brady. Mm-hmm. And she's coming on. She's, she's been so aroused. Yeah, she's been so aroused. Yeah. And she's beautiful. And of course, he's handsome, of course. Yeah. So here's the deal. So everybody, hold on. Here we go. Okay. Hold everybody, on. hold on. Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> okay. Oh, sorry. Follow this. Holding. So, These are always... Yeah, they're always crazy. So Jackson, Sonny. Jackson, Sonny. We'll just call him Sonny at this point. He is the son of Justin and Adrian. So you got that part. Mm-hmm. Claire... Is the daughter of Sean Douglas and Belle, and Sean Douglas is the son of Bo and Hope. Right. So they're basically a Kyriakis's, both of them, Claire Brady and, of course, Sonny Kyriakis. So Justin and Bo are first cousins. Justin and Bo, and Bo. are first Right, okay, right. Sonny and Bo are second cousins. They get there. Sonny and Sean Douglas are third cousins. So that makes Sonny and Claire fourth cousins or first cousins removed four times. Mm. Now here's another side Sonny note. Sonny and Claire? Sonny and Claire. Okay. Here's another side note. Sonny was married to Hope's nephew, Will. So they're related Wait, through Sonny marriage. Sonny was married to Hope's nephew, Will. Will. Oh, right, okay, got it. Yes. <laughs> so they're sort of related that way through marriage. Right. Claire is also Hope's granddaughter. Ooh. Claire is also Hope. Uh, it's true. Okay. And... When Claire was born, she was born to Kyriakis because we thought she was Phillips. Mm. Mm, that's right. Remember that? Mm-hmm. Okay. So now her and Philip are like great niece, great nephew kind of thing at this point. But they're related that way. So that's like who's related. Nice. You know, I feel like you should come on the show as a, a representative of Ancestry. I was that's so funny. Ooh, I, I was know. like, we should yeah. go on Ancestry yeah. and create yeah. the trees. Yeah. Oh, so I'd, lo- I'd love to do that. I bet yeah. someone's done that. Somebody had to have done that. I bet someone. Cheryl probably has done it. <laughs> Check. Somebody will write. <laughs> or Susie. Or Susie. Cheryl or Susie, Susie. has done it. I'm that's sure. a great idea. I like this. See, the thing about Tony is he makes work for all of us. I love that. But he actually will. You write storylines in. I want to do Ancestry. I want to do that. Yeah. yeah. Right. Do it. We'll see. I'll come on as Maxine's son. Yes. yes. You come on. See, this would be the perfect time because they're about to celebrate the, the bicentennial. Yeah. Yeah. And you could have went to Horton Town Square and just had this huge tree. Yes. Mm-hmm. Oh, of like how all God. these people are related. I would love mm-hmm. to do that. I would that love is so that. neat. Hashtag missed opportunity. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Um, so now let's get on to Mark's quarter of the week. <laughs> okay. Yay. Oh, well, as I said, it's not Rafe. <laughs> <laughs> Although I'll give him an honorable mention because he had a lot of good zingers. Um, and Nicole wasn't on this week. No. So I didn't have her to rely on. And Victor was being all sappy nice to Caroline. So I was like, well, I'm getting nothing here. So I went with it, the line that made me go, yes! 
Okay. Oh, wow. When somebody said it, because okay. it was so spot on, perfect. Okay. And it does happen to be my friend Michael Cardell. Oh, my, oh we like Michael. We like Michael. <laughs> He's my old roommate. I don't know if you knew that. Oh, um, yeah. Great guy. Great guy. Uh, I'm sure he could tell you fun stories about me. Um, <laughs> when he said, when he walks up to Paige and JJ and says, <laughs> "Y'all spend a lot of time together for two people who don't like each other." <laughs> no, oh my God. Exactly. <laughs> and they're always telling each other, no. "I hate you. I don't well, want to see I you. you. Right. I don't want to see you. Yeah. Leave right. me alone." Right. It's like, then why are you having this? Lengthy conversation. Right. Go again, yes. and again. you keep going to the mother, the mother's house to talk to the mother, and you keep going to this person to talk to her. She did the same thing with Eve when she yeah. was mad at Eve. Yep. Yeah. I hate you, but I'm going to come to the house and I'm going to have a tea, and I'm going to sit on the <laughs> couch and I'm going to pretend yeah. I don't know who you are. And blah, right. Blah, blah. Right. I'm like, ugh. So that, so Michael Cardell, Aww. not because you were my roommate, yeah. because that was genius. Yeah. Thank you very much yes. for quote of the week. We like Michael. I'll um, tweet him out. Well, now, fans, uh, we are now going to sit and have a chit-chat with the one and only Miss Melissa Archer. Yay! Yay! There's so much to talk about, too. I love it. We're oh going to take your questions yes. live, and we're going to take your, your calls live. So feel free to call us in uh, with your question for Melissa, because we, we're going to chit-chat with her and, yes. and catch up with her. And find out what she's been doing yeah. since, uh, you know, she wasn't on this Sam. week. <laughs> yeah, well, she actually what happened last week, Melissa? <laughs> right. yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, okay. Yeah, oh, so, I didn't know something that. Like that. I know something's going on. Okay, first of all, I know we're going to talk about Days of Lives, but I just have to ask you just yeah. two questions about wanting to live. Please, God. Erica Slezak. Yes. Go. Oh, my God. <laughs> so a legend. A legend. No, I mean, let me, she, I mean, she plays your mother. Yeah. First and foremost, she is just as eloquent as a person as her character was. Okay. Um, and she's such a phenomenal actress. Yeah. It's There was a time we had this scene, and she was... Uh, just me and her, and she's telling me this amazing story and, like, crying, and I'm like... This is just me, and I'm just staring at her, and I, I'm like so entranced, and I had a line, and I totally forgot because it was, I was into it. I didn't want to interrupt her. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, we were supposed to, of course. Yeah, right, like, right. Oh, yeah. I was like, no, keep going, keep going. Like, it was really good. Okay. Well, uh, we we, we have, have a, a caller on the yes. line. Caller, welcome. You are on live with us here at AfterBuzz TV for Dish and Days. Um, what's your name, and where are you calling from? Hi, Cheryl from South Carolina. Hi, Hi Cheryl. Hi, Cheryl. How are you? I'm pretty good. How are you? Doing and I do wonderful. not have any ancestry uh, <laughs> any of the Brady's, the Hortons, or the Curios. I, I figured you'd be the only one that would. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually out there on about.com, though. Oh, <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Okay. okay, I'll look it up. I'll look it up. Okay. I'll look it up. Nice. What is your question, Cheryl? Anyway, two things. First of all, I want to tell Melissa that although I did not like the character of Serena... I love Melissa Archer, and I think she was completely squandered. Oh, yeah. thank you very much, I mean, Cheryl. I, I, I really I would love to see you come to GDH. There, there's <laughs> been lots there's been talk today. I watch besides lots Dave. of talk. There's been talk today about that. Cool. I, I would love that. <laughs> and I want to know if you hated the elephant as much as the viewers hated the elephant. <laughs> Let me tell you something. <laughs> The day I got to beat up the elephant. <laughs> I think we even said was this. was one of my most favorite I think we even yeah. said she probably thoroughly enjoyed doing that. Oh, yeah. And I stabbed you my toe because I kicked it You could not break that thing. I yeah. mean, I watched you beat that thing and, and you did some little damage to it. Yeah, well, we were, we were all there with sure you. I sure it got done. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. We should have made a gif of that. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. Well, thank you. Awesome. It was great talking to you. I'll let you go so somebody else can join. Thank, thank you, Cheryl. Thank you, Cheryl. You're wonderful. Um, I think we have another caller. Oh, Wel welcome to uh, AfterBuzz TV. Uh, you're on live with Dish and Days. What's your name and where are you calling from? Um, uh, my name is... Uh, hello? Yeah. yeah. Hi. Can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. Hello? Uh, hello. Hi. Can you hear us? My name, my name, Randy. Randy. Hi, Randy. I'm, I'm calling from, from West Hollywood. From West Hollywood. Oh. Nice. West Hollywood, West Hollywood, Florida. Florida. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. okay. Great, good. Okay, good. Randy, what's up? I, I have a question for, for Melissa Archer. Okay. okay. Hey, Miss Melissa. Hey. <laughs> what was your, like, 17 favorite things about working with Paul Telsa? <laughs> 17. <laughs> 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 you can start at number 17 and work up. 
or start number one and work down. Oh my god, I love this you. This is the best call. This is the best call. Okay. Oh my god. Well, I can't even. I was so confused because of the lag between the <laughs> YouTube and the phone, but whatever. <laughs> hey, Melissa, how are you doing, darling? Oh my god, how are you, my love? <laughs> yeah, we actually have Paul tell her oh, on the phone yeah. now. <laughs> I'm like, he sure does have a twang for West Side. Yes, I know. Oh my God. I thought it for a second that I was like, well, I don't know that. <laughs> that call that you were worried about. Yeah. Hi, Paul. Oh, Paul. How are hey, you? Hey, guys. How y'all doing? Hello, beautiful. You all right? Oh, They're nice, aren't they, really? Fantastic. They're so great. <laughs> and I'm not being handsy either, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I can't see below the table. I can't see what's going on there. Now. <laughs> well, you and Paul had like some interesting scenes yes. with with each other. Although my favorite is still the picture in yes. bed with the elephant. <laughs> the <laughs> selfie. <laughs> the yes. selfie. That is well, still that's, that's still my favorite. Yeah, that's you know what we do. We just take pictures of things we steal. <laughs> in bed. That's so funny. It's a turn on. So speaking of those 17 things. <laughs> <laughs> um, so let's start with the accent. Ooh, yeah. Right. Yeah. Ooh. Right. <laughs> well, so Paul, what were two things you liked working about with Melissa? How about 17? <laughs> I'm starting with two at the moment. I think I was like, start the time. She can go on and on. We do have three hours, remember? Oh, that's right. Three hours. Three hours. hours. <laughs> but Paul, what did you well, like? I'm going to say Melissa was the first person to show me where the commissary was. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> so I was very grateful. That's important. Uh, uh, on top yep. of just being fantastic scene partner, that she made sure that I was fed. Aww. It's important that you eat. <laughs> <laughs> a well-balanced meal before a scene. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. I love it. Uh, a man's heart's through his stomach. That's yep. right. Yep. That's true. That's and I don't know if you were watching last week, Paul, but... Um, James gave you a big shout out on uh, for Thursday's episode because you were shirtless. You were shirtless and sweaty. <laughs> I was like, "Thank you, thank you, everybody, thank you." Yeah, Paul. They, they had to squeeze one more in before they, they, they gave the boot. Um, <laughs> well, I feel like it was kind of early to be like up and sweaty yeah. and shirtless. That's just me, though. <laughs> I was like, it's like, it's like eight, not for seven, Xander. Not for Xander. No. no, no. He could do it all. Day. In all honesty, I, I think they just uh, reallocated all the budget somewhere else <laughs> as in terms of like Xander, Xander's costumes. Because all of a sudden, I went from like sweet Armani jacket to you know overalls, looking like a UPS man, <laughs> then no clothes, and then I end up in this prison jumpsuit. Yeah. So you know, yeah. I can't go, wait go, go to save see those that pennies. Too. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's so funny. I keep seeing that picture. I can't wait to see that. Too. Yeah, I just saw it before I left for here. It was funny. I haven't seen it yet. Pretty cool. Yeah. Well, I'll I'll text Melissa later for a proper <laughs> chat. But, uh, I'll, I'll, let, I'll let one of the fans take over, so I'm not hogging anybody's time. But it's nice to hear from you guys. Same oh, here, same here from you, Paul. Bye. 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 Oh, how fun. Surprise! Surprise. Surprise. <laughs> I, 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 OMG. I, I feel kind of bad because like he messaged me earlier, but okay. I didn't tell you guys. Yeah. But, but I had to like. Oh, that's, that's, great. that's totally great. That's great. I yeah. love that. Um, that's great. Can I read one mm-hmm. here just because it's yeah. Daquan yes. and he says in parentheses, "I probably won't yeah. read the question, yeah. um, but I'm going to just to prove him wrong because um, <laughs> that's the kind of relationship me and Daquan have." Uh, Melissa, yep. Daquan would like to know. And it pains me to read this question. Uh-oh. What was it like working with Allison Sweeney? Molly Burnett. Oh! <laughs> Why? I have I have Melanie issues. So oh, go ahead. See, not Molly, Molly issues. Yeah, no, Molly's Molly's awesome. Awesome. Melanie yeah. issues. Um, and the character Melanie, I mean, we we have all this great backstory, so yeah, right. it was fun. Yeah. Um, and then we pretty much didn't do anything Never, after that. Right. No. So um, but yeah, Molly Burnett's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we, we would hang out uh, you guys saw Australia, the no. The what? No? Did, no one saw that. No. No one saw that. No one saw that. Thank you, Juan. So it was. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Eric, Marta, and Molly and I. So Molly can do no in Australian very well, <laughs> uh-huh. and we can't. And so we put it on Instagram, uh, and it's literally just us saying no. And I, I'll do it for you right now, okay. which is really bad. So okay. <laughs> no. You know, and I, I that sounded it. pretty good. Yeah, that I guess good. good. Really? Because that's yeah. the only time that. <laughs> <laughs> you watch that video, and then you just talk about it later. <laughs> so funny. That's so funny. <laughs> so there you go, Daquan. Now leave me alone. See, there you are. Love Molly. Um, was there any time like during 
well, first off, I always like to ask this question to everyone. Mm -hmm. Did you ever audition for Days no. before? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so you oh. came in just as uh, Serena? Yeah, but you were pretty well known from... Another from show. one life yeah. 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 Well, I mean, sometimes you never know. There are people who have auditioned for sure. like other roles, so sure. and it's always interesting to find out what well, else. Well, when I got one life to live, I actually auditioned for Jen, and then oh. later came back in and was a, it was a different character name. It was like Valerie, and then they changed it to Natalie. But yeah, yeah. Oh, how funny. Uh -huh. Here's another uh -huh. good question from uh -huh. Emma. Emma, uh, she wanted to know who would you have liked to have had a scene with. Oh, I like that question. Oh. Um, That's a good one. Even though I did have a scene with John Aniston, for, uh, Victor, right. um, I really wanted to have like a storyline. Yeah. yeah, I yeah. love him so yeah. much. Yeah, he's he's just awesome. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what what did you like about playing Serena? Because she came in when we were first introduced to Serena, she seemed a bit all over the place. Uh huh. And then she's like kind of sneaky, but not. But she's not really great at lying, but she does. Like. Right. I feel like that's how everybody comes in because they don't really know. They don't want to give anything away. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's the tricky part because I actually really liked her in the very beginning, but I think it yeah. was a little more solid in the very beginning because the one thing that you could get from it is that she wanted to be with Eric. Right. And mm -hmm. so I kind of liked that up until. Um, the lying did start taking, you know, basically when I was start searching for something. Yeah. Um, and we had no idea what it was. We were so oh trying to figure out what was oh in that God. elephant. I thought it was a million dollars, but well, it was and I, don't even think, I don't even think the audience knew it was the elephant at first. I think no. I was just looking for something. Yeah. And, um, and I think that's where, it's not that that was bad, it's just that it went on for as long as it did, and so there, that's all that was happening, is that every yeah. time someone would walk in the room, it's like, oh, uh, what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, and that's, um, that's the that's that's the challenge with yeah. it, um, but I, I did like Serena um, as there are certain things about her her strengths that she had and mm -hmm. the way she could hold her own, mm -hmm. um, even when she was scared of Xander. Um, I felt that she could really hold her own with him. I mean, he might every once in a while make her jump back, but I think that she could fake it with him yeah, really well. And tough. I think that yeah, she's tough, and she wasn't. She wasn't like scrappy, like street tough, but she was tough. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And like very, you know, I don't know. I yeah. like that. I agree with you on that one, yeah. Because yeah. I ain't like that. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm scared of everything. I'm glad to say that I'm sorry. Like, oh, look at that. <laughs> See, what if, like, Hashtag Maxine Sun came in, <laughs> and go. if if they had kept Serena, Shots. like I could have like worked with Serena, we could have been like BFFs. That would have been great. And then I my BFF left like five minutes later. And then I could, I mean, this I, this may sound bad, but I could have been working with y'all in Africa too. Oh, that would have been so great. <laughs> You Same. helped. You helped. I did. You're the one who switched the elephant in Africa. Oh, there you go. And yeah. that's how it got in Eric's stuff. It's all your fault. Your part yeah, to mirror. Never really got explained. Huh? Boom. 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 Never really you, you, explained it. You know what I always thought was so funny was that you carried that elephant around with you everywhere. And Did your you? purse was big enough to just always have it. <laughs> like, like girls carry big purses already, right. but like... To, Serena had a, a purse for everything. So, yeah. you know, when she needed to carry around an elephant, she had that right. one. Boom. Yes. Yeah. Again. Huge. Huge elephant. Yeah. Chris, Chris Miller wants to know what it was like working with Craig Vaughn. Oh, oh okay. Greg. He's <laughs> awesome. He's so sweet. First of all, fellow Texan, so yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, no, he's he's just a wonderful guy and so much fun. His, had, his contract just got... Uh, extended. I saw so, that. Had you guys ever seen, because you guys, he was on other ABC shows. No, you guys we never met? worked no. together. And mm -hmm. I'm, in fact, I don't think we'd actually, we, if we did meet, it was one of the, you know, yeah. it's like, hi, yeah. but, you know, yeah. in passing or what have you. Um, but, yeah, the first time we'd actually met. But I'd heard so much about him. He mm -hmm. works um, with the same woman I do yeah. for our fans and stuff. Oh, so, wow, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let's connect that way. Debbie O'Connor. Now, one Shout thing out. that you have been working on recently is uh, Viral the Series. Yes. yes. And um, I believe we have a trailer uh, for well, that. Well, I hope you guys like it. Yeah. <laughs> so um, let's take a look at the trailer, and then we'll come back and chit-chat about it for a okay. little bit. Okay. Yes. Hopefully I didn't catch Steven off guard. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> trailer? <laughs> Sorry, ladies. Uh, boss said that's it. I'm gonna have to go too, and nobody else is open around here. I know what to do. Yes. What are you doing? That's so funny. I am woman, hear me pee. Whoa. What do we have here? The pee pee sisters, I can Stop filming. Get out of here. Oh, there's, there's not a chance. Queen of the of the Yellow Nile. Wait. I wasn't sure if it was you or not without all that puke on you. 
<laughs> Everybody wants to meet you. The paparazzi no, wait, can I please just at least get a quick selfie with you guys? We'd love to. <laughs> <laughs> CP. <laughs> oh my God. Do you think Patty saw it? What the hell were you thinking? Everyone will be trying to see which of us has the bigger package. Oh, this is... I hear that's a closer race than a trophy. This video is the worst thing to ever happen. I feel like you guys are just looking at the negative side of this. I can't right possibly right. see how there could be a positive side. Yes, everybody is talking about it. Everybody is oh, my man. About it. Oprah to Taylor Swift. <laughs> Even Betty White said, been there, girl. Hashtag I am woman here. Repeat. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Betty White is on Twitter. Yeah. Betty, Betty White is, is Twitter. Twitter. I love, I love that. <laughs> Anything I can do to make us get past this. I just don't think I'll ever be able to look at you in that way again. Boom. Yes. You are Amazing. so hilarious. I watched all of them in a row. I was just yeah, like I watching. Did I, I, did. I was like, yeah. they were you were hilarious. Yeah. What, what a comedian! A, what oh. I like about it is that it's so a take on like what's happening now yeah. and yes. how yeah. the silliest of videos can go viral. viral. And They're obviously, this is like one of those videos that mm -hmm. someone took, and mm -hmm. then someone. I love when people like take a viral video and then make a video out of it, <laughs> yeah. like right. a song and stuff. Right. So I was like, I'm totally down for this. Yeah, yeah. And I love how your character is all about it. Uh -huh. You're like, oh, I, I mean, so what? Something a few million people like, saw it. <laughs> yeah. like, what happened? You know, gotta get your 50 minutes of fame somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. Right? <laughs> where did where did the idea for this come from and how did you become so, a part of it? Um, Brandon Gons, who is one of our co-writers, he, um, he had kind of brought up this this the, uh, a little <laughs> 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 um, <laughs> he had brought up at, at one of our meetings he had said you know wouldn't it be funny if you know this happened and that happened and then Jessica and I just basically started acting out in a restaurant um, oh, yeah that's what we do <laughs> yeah. um, power lunch and so um, about two days later I swear to god uh, Brandon and Sonia had written the script and sent it to us wow. and we were like holy crap this is amazing yeah. I am allowed to say that one right? yeah, 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 yeah crap, um, <laughs> god. crap. Um, body mouth there <laughs> so um <laughs> Yeah, so I was really, really excited when I saw the script. I was just like, oh my god, this is funny. This is really funny. And yeah. then shortly thereafter, we just basically decided to, let's produce this. Let's do it. Yeah. And then we did. No, it is it is hilarious. Yeah. Completely, I completely. love it. Like, the, the first scene when you guys were coming out of the bar, yeah. I was just like, classic girls coming <laughs> out of the, the bar. bar. Yeah, 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 exactly. yeah, yeah. Totally. I mean, I've been there. Yeah. <laughs> I've been there too, girl. <laughs> I've been there too. I think I was there a oh. <laughs> Now, where can everyone see uh, the. Because you have three episodes out now. Yeah, where so can it's a three part pilot, and mm -hmm. you can see it on viraltheseries.com. Um, and just go check it out. It's right there on the homepage, and you can yeah. watch all three yeah. episodes. And we'll make sure we'll, we post a list yeah. in our disc uh, a link in our description so that you guys can watch it. So make sure you support Melissa. Go like it, share it, subscribe to it, watch yes. it. It is hilarious yeah. and very funny. Guys. So yeah. completely agree. Yeah. And Jessica, of course, is one of your Why Not to Live co-stars. Yes. You guys stayed friends. Yes, we obviously, did. Obviously, obviously. <laughs> but I wanted to ask just one, more, one other question about Why Not to Live that uh -huh. a lot of fans are too asking me is the same thing. You worked with Bree Williamson. Yes. Who played Jessica Tess and all that. Mm -hmm. There, there was a scene. It was a very famous scene where they brought back Nikki Smith. Right. And you had to deal with all of them. It was like Tess and Nikki and all that. How did you deal with I mean, these brilliant and you were, and you never became a second person either. I'm surprised. No. Well, I think that was actually that that was the kind of the interesting thing that I liked about Natalie is that um, she didn't have that to fall onto. Right. You know, they that that was their their split personality was because they couldn't their brains couldn't handle yeah. the, the trauma and the emotion. And granted, I'm not saying that anything like that necessarily happened to Natalie, but she was left to face everything yeah. that mm -hmm. came her way. Definitely. So, you know, I, I, I but I did think it was really interesting when she had to deal with all of them. And there were, it was all of them. But yeah, no, I know. Yeah. And it was amazing scenes that were, episodes that were going with that. Yeah. And, you, and you were like the sane one kind of out of the group going, okay, wait a minute. So i got to figure right. all this out. Like, who's what? So yeah. you were on, you were on Watch Live for how long? Um, ten years on ABC, uh -huh. and yeah. then the Prospect Park. Prospect version. Park thing. Mm -hmm. So coming on to days, what some of the some of the differences you found on both soaps? Um, I guess, 
you know, it's the, the differences are, are small and large at the same okay. time, but they're it's kind of hard to explain. But I guess, um, for instance, our studio floor was much smaller at One Life than Days. Oh, we have two okay. studios at Days and um, and only one, and it was teeny. Oh really? Um, for oh, One wow. Life, comparatively speaking, yeah. Well. Um, the, so therefore, there's more room for more sets. There's not as much turnaround going on, mm-hmm. um, and I would think. Well, and also, like, the, the hours that we work, because at days, I think we're done, like, around, it was, like, six, wow. late to seven. Oh, yeah. Wow. Um, That's great. I know at One Life, uh, especially on the ABC one, I th- you know, it could go seven, could go eight, sometimes it go two if you had, like, a really big, you yeah. know, tornado thing or what have you. <laughs> <laughs> big wedding flashback. tornado. Mm-hmm. Yeah, flashback, I love yeah, that. Yeah, um, and, um, <laughs> and then the, the Prospect Park one was yes. also a lot longer. Um, I have to say about Prospect Park, it was funny to hear um, cussing on it. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. A lot yeah. of fans didn't like it, I know, but I kind of yeah. liked it was more real. I kind of like. I think it. there was a happy medium. I yeah. think that you know, I think that it was good that we were kind of bringing the, that little bit of realness to it. But mm-hmm. I think that when it became a thing of oh cool, we can say it, let's just say it. Yeah. It, that got a little too pointed. Yeah. Right. And I think it was a little too obvious. And right. I think it got maybe a little too much because you don't want it was it was great that we were going into a new world with yeah, it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. I think that you need to bring everybody together versus like alienating this audience to bring on a new audience. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Now, um, fans are, are are wanting to know about these upcoming scenes because as we've seen thus far, um, we know that a serial killer is now on the loose in Salem. Snap! And it looks like Serena's gonna be the first to go. Or maybe she's the serial killer and that promo was a fake. Oh, <laughs> wow. um, Damn. What yeah. What were your thoughts when when this came about? Was it like surprising to you? Were Were you kind of shocked? Taken back? Did you know beforehand? Or, um, I knew. When did I find out? It was like it, maybe in February. I found out. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. And I think I was done in March. If yeah. I, oh wow. Maybe I found out. I can't remember. I don't yeah. know, Honestly. Yeah. But yeah, somewhere around there. So um, I think I had a few weeks. Yeah. Were you surprised at all, or? Mm, I mean, I think I felt it coming. To be yeah. quite honest, yeah. I mean, honestly, knowing that my character was dealing with the blood diamonds way back when, yeah. I was like, yeah. How typically, I mean, I didn't know right. I was gonna die, but yeah, yeah. right. You know, yeah. <laughs> but you don't, you don't feel the longevity right. after you, you know. Yeah. I mean, yeah. unless you're Victor. Or, right. You know. Yeah. <laughs> right. Certain yeah. people, Marlena. Was there? Because right. uh, we read the the article with with Ken and how he said that he, you know. Basically, took the bull by the horn and sure. kind of, you know, reshaped and reformed days. Sure. What was it like, you know, there on set? Was there this mm. feeling of like not knowing what was happening or like what was kind of like the when, mood? Um, when, when the guess, writers changed? Yeah, when changes started happening. Well, yeah, because I think I can't remember exactly, but I want to say it was maybe right after Christmas that we found out about um, Chris and Gary, mm-hmm. and then it was just. You know, anytime there's a, reg- a regime change of any sort, you know that there's that good possibility of there's going to be some major changes. Change, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It doesn't always happen, but it, it happens often. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I think there was a little bit of, hmm, I wonder what's, mm-hmm. you know, what's this going to be, yeah. what's this going to be. Um, and then, you know, after Lisa was let go, um, I think I was let go like the same week or the, no, I think it was the following week. So, yeah. um, but once I knew she was gone, I, I don't know. I just was like, I think I'm going to get a cold. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Had you been uh, on, I was feeling inside. <laughs> when you were on One Life to Live, um, had one of these writing change, like some one of these things happened to you before? Well, I've never been let go, but yeah, I've been through oh, several yeah. head writers, and mm-hmm. you watch like whoosh, everybody yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. serial killers coming to town. It's very frequent. <laughs> yeah. um, they come off everybody. And like you're the like, tornadoes wow, okay. and things yeah. happen. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Disaster. Disaster. Yeah. Disaster. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Um, no, we had plenty of those. So yeah. 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 And in fact, I think while I was there, I feel like we had at least three serial killers in yeah. town. Yeah. Um, I have a question, mm-hmm. and I have a photo to go with it. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Okay. Stephen will put up my first photo, my set, well, a second, however, order. I don't know what kind of order you have these in. It's the Serena and Chad oh. photo, Ooh. the first one. Oh. What is going oh. on <laughs> with my Chad? I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm not sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that, and I was like, <gasps> I mean, if you'll notice here, there's a big old bottle Pilot. of alcohol. Yes, yes. And if I remember correctly, they might have been having lots of that that mm-hmm. day. Um, which leads to the that. next photo, I do believe. 
Ooh. You smack him. Look, look at homegirl back here with the side hair She's slap. Like, what? She's like, what? Or you smacked her and her hair tossed to the side. <laughs> yeah, look at her. Look at it. But I have to. So look at that wind. Look at that. Yeah, that's yeah. cleavage. Like, you've got girl. some, like, pow- you're like looking at him like, I'm not taking I'm your gonna, shiz anymore. I'm going to hurt you. Yes, that was, that was hard, hard for me to see. Yeah. That was very yeah. hard for me to see. <laughs> yeah. He liked it. I have a feeling well, it. He liked very it. <laughs> well, it was so hard. Look, this is Mark's reaction. This is Mark. That's low range. Lorraine is kind of like, excuse you? <laughs> what are you doing? Did you just what, did you? Like, and what, what you guys don't realize is that uh, Lorraine gets up to save Chad. Oh, yeah, right, yes. of course. Yeah. That's yeah. what happens. Yeah. That was the, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's in the writing. You're you in the background there. That's kind yeah. of interesting. A lot of prep and going on over there. There's, yeah. a, there's a lot. You know, I think Chad actually just asked her to hit him, I think is what happened. Yeah, okay. He was asking for it. Yeah, I think he was like, hey, I kind of like it when. This week is going to be a very interesting week yes. because I mean it kicks everything off yeah. and like there's yeah. just judging Boy, by the yeah. <laughs> yeah just judging by the previews it looks <laughs> like you know Serena's dead Chad is wondering like what, what did happened I do? Well, he like, thinks he did it and there's a whole seven there was a whole seven days to go campaign kind of because next Friday. Someone returns. Oh, uh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we got a big joke. Yeah. Patch. Patch. Patch, yeah. Okay. Patch along it was, with Joey. Joey. It's with Joey. Yeah. But yeah. it's like, there all of a sudden he walks in and he, and he, says, he says sweetness. And you're like, oh my God. Yeah. Yeah. It's 1995. And yeah. that'll be the last scene on Friday. Yes, so you won't see anything until Monday. Yeah, of course. Uh, We're course. excited though. Yeah. Yeah. But, but you're having a big week coming up. Uh, yeah. are, you re- are you ready? Are you ready? Okay, so here's the deal. Like I said, this is my first death scene. And more importantly, I don't know if you can tell from the whole picture how okay. I die. So it's it looks like a, no. a tie or something. I won't totally give it away, but just hint, hint, look at the picture. Yeah. yeah. So, um, <laughs> it looks like there's a tie. Like she's straight. Yeah. So I'll there's a tie and a heel. <laughs> <laughs> it was the rain! <laughs> I knew it was you the whole time. A heel. But all I'm saying is, like, I was really trying to make it look as real as possible. Okay. Like what happened right. to yes. her. Okay. Um, so I hope it looks really good. And oh, if it okay. doesn't, tell me it does. Okay, thanks. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> NC. <laughs> Cut print. Yes, we will definitely right. tell you that. That's very exciting. Yeah. 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 So we're gonna be here next week to talk about to it. chit chat about it. Dang. Yeah. Dang. Mm. You, have to, you have to tune in and watch us. Yeah. We're talking I'll, about I'll you. have to call in and be like, yeah. 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 Oh, my God, did you like it? And you're like, uh-huh. Yeah. You can totally do that. <laughs> it was the best death scene on Earth. You're yes. like, oh, my God, that was classic. Okay. I'm going now. Um, before, we, uh, before we wrap things up, let's go into some quick news and gossip. Okay. Um, After Buzz TV Ooh. News. Okay, so it was just announced that uh, Pop TV will now start re-airing that day's episode of days Mm -hmm. Um, so you can tune in at 8 p.m. on Pop TV and watch that Days, days episode later, starts in, the day. later in the day, yeah. starting tomorrow, August twenty fourth. So, so if you get yeah. preempted somewhere, you can yeah, that's watch. really cool. Yeah, yeah. Cool. yeah. Sure. or like you know, if you do, we had doesn't a little preempt. We did. We there, did was a, there was a Friday. breaking news report, and I was like, breaking news report. Me too. On Friday. Yeah. yeah. Like, oh, don't you hate that? Do you, OJ Simpson? Do you guys remember that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yes. none of our stuff yeah. on. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Did I just age myself? Not at all. Right there. Don't worry. That was when you were before you were sore. Yeah. <laughs> you, were, you were little uh, Natalie. Yeah, little Natalie. I was like, where's my young man? Um, really quick before I before I move on, there is one of our watchers, Rock uh, or Rook King, um, who was very upset that they weren't able to get through to the lines uh, to talk to you. So if you could give a little shout out to, I think it's pronounced Rook King. Rook King. Yeah. Rook King. Hey, hey. I'm so sorry I didn't get to talk to you, but. Next time. Next, <laughs> next time. time. Yeah. Next, time. next time. When she does ghost scenes. In yes. <laughs> yes. Oh my God. Yes. Let's do this. I know. They do it all the time on soaps. You do it all the time. Even if it's off camera. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if it was off camera. <laughs> so when Nicole and Eric get together, then the ghost of Serena comes in. Yes. Yeah, she's like, mm, I'm going to flicker these lights and it ain't going to be romantic. <laughs> oh, I love it. Um, also, could you give a shout out to Brittany Peacock? Hey. There we go. <laughs> got it. We we got to keep y'all happy because Rook was like, I can't get through. I'm not watching Dish and Days anymore. And I'm like, no, please don't do 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 All right, stay with us, please. Yes, yes. Um, so, okay, so then, um, also to let you guys know, Martha Madison, who we all know will be Woo-hoo! coming back yes. as uh, Belle. Yes. Um, we were all at the Winterthorn premiere yes, yes, we were. Um, of her oh, new uh, web series. Yes. Um, it is uh, absolutely amazing. fantastic oh, and amazing. Yeah. Yes. Um, it is very I interesting. Want that collar. For, right? For oh, me, amazing. I kind of describe it as Devil Wears Prada meets Willy Wonka. Yes! Yes! Oh, yeah. 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 So, um, it's so out the visually, oh, I was stunning. telling Michael this. Stunning. I was blown away at the costumes, the costumes makeup. I agree. Yeah, I agree. The, I agree. The, that scene with the lollipops blew yes. my mind. You have it blew to, my mind. I was like, to, somebody then. literally yeah. <laughs> walked around the forest for probably a half a day <laughs> sticking those lollipops in the ground. I know. And somebody bought all those lollipops. Like, exactly. Yeah. I doubt More they were really. donated. Yes. But it was just, I loved visually. I just thought it was. Amazing. No, it was. It was. Amazing. It was beautiful. Yes. Are, are you in it or you were just there supporting? I'm not. I was just okay. there supporting. Well, no, at least not right away. Right. Maybe down the road. Right. Maybe down the road. Never know. We'll put in a good word. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, guys. Uh, so make sure you guys tune into the premiere. It yes. happens on August 27th. Yes. Uh, check winterthorn.com um, for the series, and we'll make sure we put the link uh, my, down at the bottom. My S, my Santa Barbara fans out yes. there, yes. my boy, yes. I always forget his name. Gordon Thompson. <laughs> Clearly he's my boy, because I don't know his name. Yeah, really. Gordon Thompson. Mason Cap. Yes, he's on there. Santa and also Sue Ellen uh, Ewing was, is on there, too, Linda yeah, Gray. He came on the screen and asked them. I went, oh! <laughs> yeah, he did, he did, he did. Oh my god, I love it. Yeah, yeah he did. Oh, he and Linda nice. Gray's on also. Gray. I had yeah. to meet her and talk to her, and I Aww. it made my life, because yes. I love Sue Ellen and everything, so it was great to see her. Yeah, yeah so make sure you guys it support it. It is a it is a fantastic oh, yes. web series, so yes. make sure you check it out. August 27th, winterthorn.com. Um, also, just a reminder, uh, if you guys would like to attend the St. Louis event, A Family Affair, featuring um, Eric Martzoff, um... <gasps> Christopher Sean, Drake Hogerson, and Hira. Um, it's a family affair. So we are giving away two tickets to the September 11th event only. That's the welcome event in St. Louis. So make sure you go like us on Facebook, Dish and Days, and on Instagram um, for Dish and Days to find out details on how you could win yes. two tickets to the September 11th event happening in St. Louis. Travel arrangements by the winner. You need yeah. to get, they yeah. need to get Martha. She's a... She's John's a family member. Other. She is. Well, that's true. We should have her there. I am black. too. Yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> I am too. I am too. We're going to make some black. And, uh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> the event is put on by uh, Starstruck Fan yes. Events, and they have a number of events happening. So for more details, make sure you check out StarstruckFanEvents.com. Yeah. Also find them on Facebook, on Starstruck Facebook. Fan yeah. Events um, as well. Um, also, we have some business to take yes, care we of. Do. Uh, oh. We have winners uh, for our Thrady giveaway yes. that oh. we were doing. Yeah. Um, so oh. our well, there's a photo for that. Oh, we're going to start giving you a photo. Everyone's coming out. Everyone, like, everyone, like, everyone, like, turns around. Um, so the winner. <laughs> I love that show. Me too. <laughs> I was on that show. Stop. <laughs> yeah, yeah. With Bob? Huh? With Bob? No, with Drew. Uh, Drew with was Drew. in my acting class. Okay. Whoa, really? Oh, was he really? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Then I, 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 from Facebook is Miss Deanna Klein. Yay. So Deanna. Deanna Klein, you are the winner, our Facebook winner. For the winner 3D giveaway? For the 3D yes. giveaway. Okay. From Facebook. Yes. Which includes what? Um, well, I'm glad you asked that, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't even planned. <laughs> Deanna, you have won an autographed mouse pad from Jen Lilly, Ooh. also a pack of 3D cards uh, signed by Jen Lilly, and a 2015 calendar Which brought to you by the fine folks <laughs> at Bill Cosi. Signed by many. <laughs> it's all signed by people. It is all signed. Can I so mention something to Congratulations. Too? Or do you have another thing? We have one more. One more. Oh, okay, one more. Um, also, the winner from our Instagram is LeeB81. LeeB81, you are the our Instagram winner. Woo! And that means you have won um, an autographed mouse pad from Jen Lilly. Also, um, cards from Day of Days signed by Jen Lilly and Molly Burnett. And you also won a 2015 calendar signed by most of the people who have appeared right here on Dish and Days. Woo-hoo! So congratulations to our winners. Thank you. Uh, Mark, you had something? Um, I just wanted to mention, too, that there is not, it's not me, even though um, 
everyone's gonna think it's me, but it's not <laughs> me. Um, there is a In Like Flynn fans official. Billy has a new official fan page. How did we know it was gonna be about Billy? By Flynn. Billy Flynn himself on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Yeah, it's does. In Like Flynn fans. He does have that on Instagram, Twitter. They post and, a lot on there too. Yeah, so that's the in official. Like Flynn. That's in, I official. say that a lot in like actually, Flynn. and like I didn't Flynn. even. Yeah, mm-hmm. well. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I want to thank everybody for, for especially, we were up to almost 1,400 likes yeah. on Facebook. Yeah. That's in a week and a half. Yeah. yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. And on Instagram, we want more on Instagram, though, so please, if you're on Instagram, find us, Dish and Days. We would like to have, we would have pictures, giveaways, all kinds of stuff. Please, please like us on Instagram. Yeah. Follow please them. Do. Yes. I will come She's, find you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. now, Not in a good way. They're, oh, thank you. I was like, that's good incentive. The <laughs> <laughs> Archer will find you if you don't like us. Yes. <laughs> Well, uh, oh, no, like them and I will come find you. <laughs> <laughs> well, speaking of liking and finding, we have to wrap things up. Yes. But before we do, <laughs> um, where can we find you, Mark J. Freeman? Uh, on Instagram and Twitter at Lorraine Love, L-O-R-A-Y-N-E-L-O-V-E. And on Facebook, backslash the Mark J. Freeman. Ooh. And Melissa, where can and you I'm find almost to uh, 500 likes. Thank you. I, oh, I saw that. I saw that. I saw that. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> um, Melissa, where can they find you? <gasps> on Instagram and Twitter at underscore Melissa Archer. And at Facebook, I think I'm Facebook.com the Melissa Archer. Forward slash the Melissa Archer. Okay. Oh, that's your fan page. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. On Twitter, you can find me at Black Hope LA. On Facebook, James Lott Jr. And my website, the superorganizeruniverse.com. And, of course, you guys can find me on all social media platforms at Lounging with Tony or my website, loungingwithtony.com. A big thank you to yes. Melissa for thank coming you. in today. Thank you, guys. And for having Brad me. Everett Young just tweeted out oh, that Brad. you and I should reenact the Chad Slap <gasps> to end the episode. Oh, we suck. Do it. <laughs> do it. Okay, here we go. Do it. Wait, who's, wait, are you playing Chad? Uh, duh. Duh. Okay. Okay. I have to stand Ready? up. Ready? Oh, wait, I should take Let's my Which way are you going to go? Are we going to go that way? Um, I'll go this. No, that way? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Ready? Okay, ready? Right. Here we go. Oh! Oh! <laughs> so soapy. So soapy. Well, thank you guys for tuning That's in to rad. Dish and Days. Uh, we are here every Sunday at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time uh, recapping your favorite NBC soap, Days of Our Lives. We will see you next Sunday where we will have special guest Michael Fairman, Fairman yes. who knows all things yeah. soaps. He will be joining us, so we'll see you next week. Bye! Bye guys. From executive producers Maria Menounos, Kevin Undergaro, Phil Svitek, and the entire AfterBuzz TV staff, we would like to thank you for listening to the AfterBuzz TV network. To watch or listen to other After shows and post comments or questions, be sure to visit AfterBuzzTV.com. I'm Sir Richard Wentworth, and this has been a presentation of AfterBuzz TV. Buzz you later. The views expressed herein are those of the hosts only and do not necessarily reflect the views of AfterBuzz TV or its owners or principals. 